18 minutes till the closing bell. Shares of Intel are lower. This is the comp as the company hosts its innovation event. Christina, back with some of the details. Hey, Christina. Well, who knew Intel CEO Pat Gelsinger was into Taylor Swift after starting Intel's innovation event with some push-ups on stage? Gelsinger demonstrated a laptop running a not yet released chip that could generate a Taylor Swift-like song using an artificial intelligence application. The point of the demonstration was to show how Intel plans to bring AI capabilities to personal computers without having to rely on the cloud, and that should in turn cut costs as well as energy use. The company announced that its Intel Core Ultra processors, also known as Meteor Lake, would be available in PCs as of December 14th. Gelsinger claims they are Intel's most power-efficient chips yet and are the first of three editions to come this year, 2024, and then 2025. No chip performance details just yet, but the company promises improvement in processing graphics and AI performance. The big question for investors as well as consumers, are these chips more efficient than Apple's M-series chips found in their MacBooks? Intel shares, though, as you t pointed out, Mike, are down today, and it could be due to the lack of detail about new foundry customers, a, a section of the business Intel is really trying to bank on, or the fact that much of these products were already expected by investors, so it became more of a sell-the-news kind of event today, similar to what we saw happen to AMD at its event back in mid-July. So you can see shares are off. Yeah, they're going falling even further, almost 5% lower right now. Yeah, and of course was set up by about a 40% gain year to date, so uh, therefore ripe for a sell the news perhaps, uh, Christina. Thanks so much.